Do you want to know why some web designs always stand out? It comes down to a few simple things that I use in almost every single project. But instead of telling you, let me show you. So see if you can spot what these web designs have in common. The first one here makes me so thirsty and I really love this purple background. And then this one, and remember they all have something in common. The last one here, I actually think I will wait with that for later in the video because that's my favorite one. So stick around for that. But did you catch what they all have in common? The secret is the background. So take a look at this web design without the video background. Ugly, right? So it just needs to have a full height video background that complements the rest of the design so it tells a story. But how do you find background like this and add them to your website? Well, that's exactly what I'm going to show you in this video. I'll create a similar design and build it live with you so you can see the process. So let's get started. Oh, and by the way, all these designs are available at my Elementor library. So you can see I can find this here. I'll leave a link in the description below so you can access it if you want to. Okay, let's go. So here we have an empty Elementor page where I will build a new design together with you. So the first thing I'll do is open a new tab and go to Envato and then change this to stock video. When I found the chocolate video, I just searched for just chocolate drop on ice cream. But I will try to create something new together here with you. So if I search for something like melted, maybe. Okay, for example, this one, really cool. Let's see it. Here we go. And you can see this also have a background, which is perfect. Because this video is also great, but it doesn't have a background. It has a white background and will it will not work. I'll just take this one, click download and up here you can see it's downloaded so i'll just open a new tab and go into my wordpress library and drag the new video in here and when it's uploaded i'll just go ahead and copy this file and use it here so i'll just create a container and make it full height just here i'll change that to view height vh and set it to 100 and then just change the background to video and insert my link here so now you can already see that it's beginning to look really cool and now we just have to build a web design around this so for example we could add a header up here and this is just a normal header the only difference is that it has a minus margin so if I remove this, you can see it's up here and it's just transparent. And let's take a look at the first example here. You can see that I have added some content here and here. And what I also did was to create some structure. So you can see this uh, is perfectly aligned or actually it's not perfectly aligned, but it should be perfectly aligned with this one and this one. So it creates a kind of invisible line. So it makes a perfect square. So let's just create some content here and here to make this looks a bit more cool. So what I could do is create something like this and make it full width. So now it suddenly looks so much cooler and I have added some content here which tells a story or tells something more about the background. And let's add some more storytelling and copywriting. It's really important actually. So I'll just insert a heading maybe here and drag it up here so i don't know if this is just two ingredients this is just something i thought sounded cool but again you can see that let's just make it a bit larger you can see that this is beginning to look really nice so let's add one more thing and then i can show you my favorite example up here okay done i think that's it for this web design i just added uh, two more things and you can see down here i have added a bottom and the only thing is that this is just a container with a minus margin. So it's the same principle with the uh, header. I just give it some minus and then it goes in front of the other content like this. And then uh, I added some chocolate here. And this is just an image of chocolate. And the same goes for this one. It's moving because I added some CSS code down here. So I can just leave this uh, in the comment. So you can also copy this code if you want to use it. Okay, let's now take a look at my favorite example. This is pretty fun and cool in a crazy way. And again, it's just a full height video background with some copywriting that tells the story. And the design is not finished, but it definitely has some potential and it's just funny. 
So I hope this gave you some insight. Okay, that's it for this video, but if you want more, then take a look at this video 